New here at 530. There's a Bengals fan throwing cookies at fans every time his team <laughs> scores touchdowns. I'd like to catch one good, of those. Catch. And Brett Bigansky <laughs> introduces us to the cookie man. To the seats. With Meet the Mark Hiltz. My father took me to the first Bengals game ever, a preseason game. Uh, August 3rd, 1968, against the Kansas City Chiefs. A man who has quite the Bengals fan resume. I did attend the Freezer Bowl. At 65 years old, he's been a Bengals season ticket holder for more than 20 years. I'm not quite as accurate as Joe Burrow. Friends and family know you as Mark, but others who may not know you call you what? I'm Papa Mark or the Cookie Man. You may have seen Mark throwing cookies in the north end zone near section 222 after a Bengals touchdown. As soon as there's a touchdown, the cookies start to fly. Mark explained the evolution of celebrating touchdowns with cookies. One day after, after tailgating, we brought some cookies in just to snack. And when the Bengals scored a touchdown, we said, hey, celebrate, here's a cookie. And they were the big bakery cookies and whatnot. Then after we passed them around and the Bengals scored, it got to be funny. So we brought in more cookies the next game and then more and more. And then suddenly it's just got to be, um, this is what we do every game. And um, I think the people in the section wouldn't let me sit down if I didn't come in with the cookies. These days with the likes of Joe Burrow and Jamar Chase, Mark brings six packages of the double stuff Oreos in these clear plastic bags. It's a one finger grip and uh, the other ones just don't sail as well. Mark has a good grip on not only the best way to throw these celebratory cookies, but also what Bengals fans love. Just fun to see the, the smile on the people's faces as we start throwing them around and uh, they're calling from rows away and across the aisle, hey, how about me, how about me? So we had a little gift to get you started for uh, the next one. The double stuff, they, they fly the best. And during the colder months, if you forget his name, <laughs> that's okay. This hoodie will serve as a reminder of who you're dealing with. Here I am, a 65-year-old man who brings cookies to a Bengals game and throws them around just to make people laugh, make, make people smile, make, just add a little bit of extra enjoyment to the game. And they're double stuffed. Mm -hmm. But here's the thing, you said cookies and milk. Would, would they taste good dipped in a beer? <laughs> Which is what the beverage of choice at, at a. I guess a after so games. many beers, everything tastes good, right? <laughs> so that's what that, they say that on the internet. That Oreo right? would always taste good. <laughs>